So today I'm talking about a P0117 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. And so what is a P0117 code? Well, it's an engine coolant temperature sensor one circuit low. And what does this mean? Well, there's a coolant temperature sensor located on the engine, and it basically just reports back to the vehicle's computer what the temperature of the engine is. And the computer's seen a problem with this, so it's got to be troubleshooted to know why. And the engine coolant temperature sensor is basically just a thermistor. And what this means is that the resistance inside of the sensor is going to change as the temperature of the engine does. So as the engine temperature goes up, as it gets hotter, the resistance is going to go down and the computer can read this and it'll know what the temperature of the engine is. And so what would be some possible causes? Well, first of all, that sensor might have just failed and might just need to be replaced. The location of the sensor is going to vary. It's, it's going to depend on the vehicle, the year, things like this. One thing to keep in mind is there can be one sensor or there can be multiple sensors. It's really going to vary. It's going to depend on the vehicle. So it's always a good idea to get a diagram where all your sensors are located and what's going on. But the first thing to go and do is going to be to locate that sensor and then test it to see if there's any problems with it. And there's some different ways you go about testing that sensor. Basically, the resistance is going to change as the temperature does. So you can't check it with a multimeter. You set it to ohms so you can check resistance. And then you heat up the sensor and then you check to see if the resistance changes as the temperature does. You should also be able to do this with an OBD2 scan tool, but you can use a multimeter if you want to. But the first thing to do is to go locate that engine coolant temperature sensor on your particular engine and test it to be sure that it's good. There can also be some kind of issue inside of the wiring. The wiring might have an open, a short, something along these lines, a bad connection. There can be two wire ones like this, or there could be three wires, or sometimes even four wires. Again, it's gonna vary, it's gonna depend on the engine. Usually when there's a three wire one, the third wire is going back to the dashboard for the temperature gauge. But again, get a diagram for your specific one to know for sure what's going on, since there can't be some differences. And the last thing on the list is gonna be that the engine's overheating, or there's some kind of cooling system issues going on. Something like the cooling fan stopped working, or the water pump, or a stuck thermostat, or something along these lines. But usually if that happens, you're gonna get other codes. So if you are getting other codes, be sure to pay attention to that. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to give a basic overview of how you go about fixing a vehicle with the P0117 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe, and have a good day.